Fighting hate tonight. Students angry over racist incidents on the campus of U of M are demanding action from the university. Simon Shaquette is in Ann Arbor with their message and how they plan to be heard. Simon. Bigotry and hatred were addressed tonight after what happened inside one of these dorms. Students say they are fed up with what's been going on and dialogue is the first step in dealing with it. We are not the majority here. We attend a PWI, predominantly white institution. Um, we're 4%. Sure. Inside a packed yeah, auditorium at the University of Michigan tonight, really members of the school's yeah. Black Student Union and NAACP chapter speaking out after recent incidents of racism. It's been pretty gloomy around here, obviously. We've realized over our time here that when stuff like this pops up, we usually don't come together. The university has publicly addressed the incidents, but students tonight say not enough has happened. Namely, they still haven't caught those who wrote racial slurs onto name tags used in the dorms. Someone also posted messages in support of a white supremacist arrested for a mass shooting at a church. A mural was defaced downtown and it said free Dylan Roof. During the gathering on campus tonight, students pulled together. At times, they fought back tears. That I'm, uh, I'm here for you all. And while many in this crowd know the problem of hate won't be fixed overnight, a sense of unity has helped start the healing. There are a lot of people here that are here to support. Um, they weren't directly targeted, but there are a lot of people that, although they weren't directly targeted, they are here to show support. Students are also planning a protest for tomorrow at 7.30 p.m. They will begin at the Student Union and end at the University President's House. From Ann Arbor, Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News. Ben